Hey guys, been a while since we put up a Q-tip, so we wanted to get one that would pique your interest. Have you ever been working in your PDM vault and you wanted to see a file listing of all the files that are in a certain folder, but just by clicking on the folder? Today's Q-tip is for you. So let's say that we're in our vault and we click on the ECO folder and we want to see a file listing of all the ECOs in that folder. Here is what you can do to get that done. It's just a simple card list that's driven by an SQL query. This is the query, and we'll actually post this in the notes so that you can actually see that below. But we wanted to share this with you. So basically, it's just grabbing all the file names, and it's removing the file extension from it and the dot so that you just get the file listing of all the files that are in there. How did we come up with this? We had a great customer ask us if this was possible, and so it was a challenge. Now, anytime we get a challenge, it's almost like, okay, we really got to show up now. So we put our thinking caps on and we put this together. All right, we run this test and it shows up. There's all of the files that are in there. If you were to look inside all these folders, they're in separate folders. So instead of having to do a search or do a uh, go down to each folder and then just kind of figure out what the names are, then you actually get all of this in one card list. And it's just by clicking on the top level folder in the engineering folder. Click on the ECO folder. And then when the card appears, you're going to see all of the files that are in there. Now this card list can be read only. There's a lot more functionality you could add to it. If you were looking for files that have a specific variable, SQL is your friend. You've got a huge database, mine it. I hope today's Q-tip's been helpful for you. Believe in the Q.